get another Dyson haul. They're my favorite things in the world to do and get. So let's just go ahead and jump into it because I've got a lot of stuff to show you. So the first thing which you will have seen in my vlog before I posted this, if you watched it, I'll link it here, was this Coca-Cola peach. It's delicious. I'm not sure if they have this everywhere or if this is just in Japan, but this is my favorite thing in the whole entire world. The next thing is this row. It had another one right here that was pink. It's um, caramel corn. It's like a kid snack. I gave JR one in the car ride on the way home. That's why there's one missing, but he really likes these. Even though I can't stand him 99.9999999% of the time, I did get Yoshi E. Squeaky toy, it is, says, pet toy meat with bone. So hopefully he'll like that because he goes through toys really fast. I'm sorry if this isn't in order. It's kind of just like all over the place random because it all got like shoved into one bag. So the next thing is, Aluminum foil. I actually prefer this Daiso aluminum foil over the expensive one, uh, the Reynolds wrap one from the, uh, like, on base, because this is a dollar and you get just as much stuff and it's a dollar. And I don't really see a difference in quality. I mostly use it just to, like, line my cookie sheets while I'm baking something or, like, cooking something in the oven. The next thing I got was these two packs. Um, they have three in each. Is these, like, brown shopping bags. I saw on Pinterest the, like, senses five senses like valentine's gift so i'm gonna do that for nolan it's like one bag says sense one or smell one says taste one says see stuff like that so i'm gonna do that for nolan i just poked myself in the nose but yeah i'm gonna do that for nolan the next thing is the cutest thing ever so i was looking and they had all these little bobble things because that's like really big here in japan is that like a little bobbly thingy thing on your like dashboard and so i was gonna get the flower one and then i saw this and i was like i live in japan why not get this one it is a sumo wrestling bobble thing Let's see if that works better yeah there you go now you can see him so yeah i can't wait to put him in my car he's so cute oh and it's solar powered which is what that is so i'm really excited about that the next thing i got for my car was a air freshener for my car it kind of looks like the febreze one so hopefully it works but for a dollar i mean you can't really go wrong. I also got toothpicks. I have the hardest time finding these on base for some reason, but some toothpicks. I use those to um, get all the cracks and crevices in his like um, high chair like tray and the actual high chair like on the arm part. Anywhere that there's like a little crack, I always clean it out and there's always gunk in it. Next, I got you these cookies. You might recognize these from my trying Japanese snacks with Nolan video and I'll link that up here too. Um, we got the blueberry ones, and I didn't really mind them. They tasted kind of like Big Newtons, but I got strawberry ones too because he loved these things. It's a really small. It's like that, and it's like his little cookie, and they not even have that much sugar in it. I could tell when I ate it. So I got these for him as little snacks, and they're all like pre, like individually packed. These are awesome. Next thing I got was this storage thing. It's only a dollar, but I'm really just trying to transition into like containers for all my stuff because I have way too many boxes and weevils are a big issue over here so I got this one it's for pasta and I have a bunch of pasta so I'm gonna go ahead and put a couple boxes in here so since I started drinking coffee recently I just got a new mug which you would see in that vlog too um, but it has a handle and I realized it barely fits in any of my cup holders it would probably fit in Nolan's but it doesn't in mine and I can reuse these because I'm you know environmentally conscious but this is like makes drinking coffee fun it's little like paper um, cups with the plastic lids. I'm really excited to use these. I couldn't find those at the exchange either. So I got three more containers. I got two of these. I mean, they're pretty decent like quality. They're pretty thick plastic. And for a dollar, I mean, I won't microwave them. They probably won't do very good in the microwave. But for a dollar to get a, like a nice, like sturdy piece of plastic, Tupperware, um, yes please. I eat a lot of leftovers and I'm always putting leftover foods in these kind of bins. So yeah, I got two of this size, it has the oranges on it. And then I got a smaller one, like compared, it's pretty smaller. This for like fruits and stuff and you know, a dollar. I mean, you can't go wrong. I'm not gonna spend $10 on two containers that are like Rubbermaid, super nice. It's just not gonna happen because they'll get destroyed eventually. So why not get the ones that are one dollar? Next is a little notebook. If you know me, you know I get notebooks every time I go there because I go through notebooks like a crazy person. 
so when we were at Angela's house, I'll go ahead and link her channel up here. I still don't know which side it is. I feel like it's this side. I don't know. She had these cut up vegetables that she got at Daiso with this little plastic knife and every single kid wanted the same toy, which was those cut up vegetables. And guess what I found at Daiso? The cut up vegetables. So it's like a green pepper, a tomato, a carrot, a cutting board, and a little plastic knife. And they're like Velcroed. And I found one of the fruit that has a watermelon, a strawberry, and a pineapple. So I know he's gonna be so excited when he sees these. I got him two more things. I got him little dinosaurs. So this one is a realistic dinosaur is all it says. I really don't even know like what it would be. But it's this thing. I let him pick out the two he wanted and then he also picked out this one. So two pretty decent sized like sturdy feeling plastic dinosaurs. Bottle cleaning brush thing. Angel has this exact one and I had no idea they sold these at Daiso because I have a I have an older one. It's pretty crappy though. And it's from the States and I've been using it for so long. I needed a new one. And this one's so good, like pretty looking. It's so pretty. And Angel said it works really good. So I'm really excited to throw out my other one and start using this one. I had no idea they had these at Daiso either, but I went ahead and got one of these mixed beads, air freshener, sweet orange scent. I always have something like this in my pantry that has my trash can and my recycles in there just to like Make sure it doesn't stink because sometimes it can stink if the trash doesn't get taken out soon enough or if there's a really poopy diaper that just would not go down the toilet. So I got one of these for the pantry. I think this is the last toy I got JR, but he has one um, that's just like this. This is literally a wind up toy and then it'll like move it for a dollar. I mean, those would be like $10 anywhere else. So he has like a little fire truck one, I think it is. And this one's a little construction truck and this thing turns so. He picked this one up too. I let him choose from three and he wanted the orange one. So I'm really excited because we love playing with these two, especially the dog. He freaks out. It's really funny. Speaking of the dog, I got him these snacks. Okay, hear me out. I saw this on one of the pet like Facebook pages I am a part of here in Okinawa. And apparently this is really popular with dogs over here because it's pretty healthy and they don't have much sodium in it and it's a good protein source for like a treat. So I got these for Yoshi. I know they're gonna stink, so I'm gonna immediately put them in a plastic bag, but it's little like fish sardines for dogs and cats. And it says up there for dogs and cats. So it's the kind that doesn't have way too much sodium in it. And they look really gross, I'm not gonna lie, but um, he is a Japanese dog. So I'll let you know how he likes these. Um, I got one more pack of these. It has gummies in it. It has an apple one, a white grape, peach, and uh, another grape flavor. So those are for to go in my diaper bag too for snacks for Bubba. I got a water because their water is just like so good. I've mentioned it before. This is my favorite brand. Um, I don't know. It just tastes so good. So I got a bottle of that. I already opened this one, but of course I had to get the peach um, little sour candies I always get every single time I go to any dice so I find these I get them they're delicious and that is everything in my bag oh my gosh I have a completely total disaster around me but it felt really good to go and get because I really wanted to get these fruits for him I really wanted to get just some cheap little toys for him I really wanted to look for these cups and I needed one of these everything else was like I I needed it, sure, but whatever. All right, that is everything I got. Wow, um, 11 minutes and 14 seconds. Let's see how far I can get that edited down. Probably not very much, but I'm very, 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 very happy with everything I got. I cannot wait to like rip this plastic part off and just start using this on his bottles. And yeah, I'm glad I got him this little like, fake fruit and everything. So yeah, um, pretty good haul from Daiso today. I did go with Angela, so make sure you check out her channel and her video. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my Daiso haul. If you want to see another one, just comment that down below. I'll take any excuse to go back to Daiso. And yes, I stayed within my budget, Nolan. I know you'll be watching this. I'm thinking that. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you turn on your bell notifications so you'll know every time I upload. I am uploading three times a week, and I will see you guys in my next video.
Bye.